this short video, I would like to show how the event logging in Xenon works and how to configure a simple event scenario. For this example, we need a variable, an internal one, and I will give it the name cell. And I will declare it as a boolean. After we create a variable, we need at least two groups, two classes and two areas to filter on them after in the audit trail. We go back to the variable and now we need to define limit value settings. We need to enable the checkbox in chronological event list and to choose one of the alarm event groups and to choose the alarm event class. Now we go to the node alarm handling and to choose the alarm area for this variable. Now we need only to deactivate the second limit value. In the next step we need to create a new screen I will name it cell and this screen need to be chronological event list screen. Now we need to create a new function, screen switch function, to go to the chronological event list screen. I will change the name of this function to screen switch to cell. Now we need to create a button on the start page to link this screen switch function to the cell screen. Now we need to create a switch button in order to initiate the cell entries. After the switch button is created, I want to give it a different look. For this, I will go to the fill mode and change the graphics of the button. Now save and compile the project and start the project. When the runtime is started, I will go to the cell screen. Create some cell entries. And now we can filter on these entries for group, classes and areas. After I select the group, now we see in the cell screen only the cell entries of this group are visible. Now I will select the class 1 and we see the same entries are visible because they belong to this class and the same for the area. After then I will choose the alarm area 1 and we can see this cell entry don't belongs to this area. And 
that's also for the class. When we disable the areas in the class, we can now see our entries. At the end, we disable all filters and now we can see all the entries again.